So I've been building Quiet Night over the last couple of years, and today I would love to share with you a really quick, effective practice, which I'm hoping is just going to give us a small break amongst our busy lives. One way in which Quiet Note has helped get involved with prescribed arts and join this community is through the wonderful help of the organization Intercultural Roots. And Intercultural Roots has been a fantastic, um, a fantastic aid to me and to a huge community. Intercultural Roots are another organization based around arts for health and social care. They work with practitioners all across the UK. They work with practitioners all across the world, delivering courses, workshops, sessions, a whole range of activities based around exactly what we're talking about here, the importance of arts for social care and for health care. So I would like to lead a very short musical meditation for us all. I'm going to invite us all to find ourselves in a comfortable seated position and if possible with both feet flat on the floor. Everything we're going to do, everything that I'm going to invite is simply that. It's, no, it's an invitation, nothing more. So please feel how the, um, the instructions work with you. If you at any point you feel any discomfort, just take a step away. It's about listening to ourselves. Mindfulness just helps us bring about a deeper understanding of ourselves. One of the biggest misconceptions as well with meditation and with mindfulness is people often think that our mind has to be still and our thoughts have to stop like a glass lake. This is actually can cause a lot of frustration for people because we sit down to do a meditation and we're like, right, I'm going to be really relaxed. I'm going to be super zen. And you try and stop. And all of a sudden your mind is thinking about everything but trying to stop and be relaxed. We're thinking about our to-do lists, our jobs, what time we've got to pick the kids up from school, all of these things. And then we think, well, I'm supposed to be relaxed. This was supposed to be my time. And I'm thinking about all of this. But the misconception is that we're supposed to stop thinking. In fact, mindfulness just helps us to give us a moment to gain more control over our thoughts. And music is a wonderful way to explore this. So I'm going to invite three things when we start this musical meditation. If you find that your mind starts to think about other things, what time this session's finishing, what time it, you know, what time this, what job I've got to do later, just become aware of the fact that you've moved yourself away from the meditation. Secondly, don't feel bad about it. We live in a society where we're constantly thinking, we're constantly multitasking. So trying to focus on one thing, that can be quite difficult. So don't feel bad about it. But thirdly, and most importantly, bring yourself back to our focus. That's the important part. Bring yourself back to the meditation. So finding our feet comfortably on the floor and sitting with a strong posture that's comfortable for you. I'm just going to give everyone a minute to find that. Even though we're in a busy day, we're not in a rush. We're just here, just taking that moment. And straight away, I want you to feel your feet on the floor. Give your toes a wiggle. Ask yourself if you can feel that connection to the floor through your socks, through your shoes. And if you find it comfortable to do so, just allow the eyes to close or move your eyes away from the screen. We have too many screens nowadays, so let's give ourselves a moment away from these screens. And then moving our focus to our seated base, our connection to the chair. How does your chair feel? Whereabouts on your body can you feel that connection to the chair? Perhaps under your legs, through your sitting bones, your lower back. How does the chair feel? Moving our attention up our spine into our shoulders and just becoming aware of any tension, any stress that we may be holding in our shoulders. Perhaps inviting a shrug, a small circle. We're not trying to achieve anything here. There's no right or wrong way to do what I'm saying. It's just a moment, just to become aware, to feel our body. And then moving our attention to our jaw, 
often a place we can secretly store tension, just allowing the jaw to relax, the cheeks to feel heavy, and the forehead to feel wide. Allowing any tension, noticing any stress held in our face muscles. I'm now going to invite you to take your hands to your stomach. And as I'm sure some of you know, when we breathe in, our diaphragm pushes down, expanding our belly. And as we breathe out, the diaphragm retracts, allowing the belly to drop. I just want you to take a moment to feel that rise and fall. Notice how I'm not asking you to change or alter the way you're breathing. Just simply to become aware of it. Feeling that movement. And now I'm going to add in that musical twist, which is on the out breath, I'm just going to invite you to hum a really quiet and gentle note. The pitch, the type of note, that's all up to you. But just allow some sound very gently to come with that out breath. Allow the note to last as long as the out breath. And when you get to that end of that breath, breathe in and just start again. Listen to the sounds, feel the vibrations. And we're just going to stay here feeling these notes just for one minute. And then just coming to the end of your note. Just checking in by asking yourself the question, how am I feeling right now? And we're not going to share that answer. So this is an opportunity to be open and honest with yourself. And then bring yourself slowly back into the Zoom. I'd like to say a huge thank you to everyone today, especially Prescribe Arts. It's been wonderful to present today. Um, and I would love to stay in touch. I'll pop my details in the chat in a moment. Um, but I think what Prescribe Arts is doing can be summed up by the word community. And I think let's continue to work to build this community because this is a really important mission. Thank you so much. Well, wasn't that a lovely thing in a really busy day? Thanks so much, Will. It was really appreciated.